Hi pre-ballet dancers. I can't believe the year is almost over. Um, we're gonna use our supplemental class today to just review everything that we learned all year. So we're gonna talk about the different steps that we've learned and the different skills that we've learned. All right, well the very first thing that we're going to talk about today are our plies. Do you remember what plie means? Hmm. Plie means to bend. All right, and we practice our plies in first position and in second position. So why don't you show me? So we put our feet in first position, which means our toes are turned out and our heels are together. Let's take our hands on our hips for this one, dancers. So you'll show me your plie. In first position, we make a diamond. We go diamond and stretch. Let's do that again. Diamond and stretch. Beautiful. All right, now let's try in second position. How do we get to second position, dancers? We should use a pointy banana foot and then we lower the heel. All right, show me your house. Ready? We bend plie and stretch. Again, show me your house and stretch. Awesome dancers. Let's go all the way back to our first position. Okay dancers, let's move right along. Up next are tondus. What does a tondu look like? That's when we stretch our foot to the side and we go all the way to our point. Good. Try that with your other foot. Stretch all the way to the side, banana foot, and close. Try it one more time. We go tondu side and in and tondu side and in. Beautiful dancers. Did you know that you can do tondus in other directions than to the side. We can do tondus to the front. We can also do tondus to the back. You wanna try with me? Let's go tondu front. We go tondu front and in. Try it with your other foot. Tondu front and in. Now let's go to the side. We go side and in. Make sure you have straight knees, pointy toes and in. Let's go right behind you. So right behind your bun and in. Make sure it's a pointy banana foot back there and in. Let's go one more time to the side. Side and in and side and in. Those were some beautiful tondus dancers. All right now we know how to point our foot. So I like to call our pointed foot our bananas. We know how to do that. What do we do when we do the opposite of a point? I like to call these our pancakes. That's also called a flex. Good, and we can do our Peter Penguin flexes. Good. How about you show me the other side? Peter Penguin flex and close and flex. Show me your pancake and Flex and in. Beautiful dancers. Another step we've been working on, dancers, are our ton liés. Can you say ton lié? Good, you guys. All right, we do these in our recital dance. So let's practice them the way that we do them in our recital dance. Take your hands, put them on your hips. You're gonna show me that beautiful tondu banana foot we just practiced. We go tondu. Then you're gonna find your house. We go house and tondu, and close. Do that again, ton lie, out, and plie, and point, and close. Let's go a little faster, and ton lie, and ton lie. Let's skip the tondu, so we'll go ton lie, ton lie, ton lie, ton lie. Beautiful job, you guys. Up next are the positions of the feet. We've already practiced some of these today at the beginning of class when we did our plies, but let's try them all together. Can you actually start with your toes together, heels together? 
All right, this is our parallel position. So toes touching, heels touching. From here, we can turn out our toes and we're now we are in our first position. Try that one more time, put your toes together. Turn your toes back out. Good job. There should be enough space in your first position for a piece of pizza or maybe a piece of pie. All right, so we have first position with our feet. Now, show me your second position with your feet. You can do a tondu together, use a banana foot and lower. This is what second position looks like. Now, we also talked a little bit about third position this year. Do you remember? You're gonna put your heel in line with the elastic on your ballet shoe. So we're gonna go banana foot and then close to third position. Make sure that heel is in line with the middle of your foot. If you have ballet shoes on, it will be in line with your elastic. Good job, you guys. Try the other third position. See if you can get the other side heel in line with the middle of your foot. Now, when we do a plie in third position, we make a tiny diamond. Try it, bend both knees. We go tiny diamond and stretch. One more time, tiny diamond. Beautiful dancers. Okay, let's put our feet back in first position. Let's try some pour de bra. Do you remember what pour de bra means? I know it sounds like it's a silly word, but pour de bra is when we do positions and movements with our arms. We do a lot of that in ballet class. Can you start with your arms down and round? We could rock a baby in these arms. Good job, you guys. All right, now take your arms to the middle. There should be enough space for Miss Carly to get inside there and you can give her a hug. Open your arms to second position. Good. They're big and round, almost like you're hugging a giant tree. Let's take our arms all the way back down. Beautiful. All right, low arms. Then we have middle arms. Can you take them all the way up to your picture frame arms? Beautiful smile for your picture. Can you make a silly face for your picture? Good job, you guys. Open your arms, show me second position again. And all the way down. Beautiful, let's go a little faster. We go all the way up and all the way down and all the way up and all the way down. Can you make a flower with your hands? So cross one hand on top of the other, make a flower. Open your arms. And one more time, make a flower with your arms. And open. Good job, dancers. All right, we've been practicing our swish arms. So we go swish and swish, and we'll go faster. Swish, swish, swish. Swish, can you do that high? Swish and swish. And swish, 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 swish. Good job, dancers. All right, let's try that third arabesque. We do alligator arms, chomp, chomp, remember? We go third arabesque, two arms in front of you, and then we go alligator arms, chomp, chomp. Try the other side. Third arabesque, alligator arms, chomp, chomp. Try it again. Third arabesque. Chomp, chomp, and third arabesque. Chomp, chomp. Good job, you guys. All right, dancers. You know what else we've worked on a lot this year? Jumps, okay? So, we've been practicing our sautés this year. We've been practicing our padishas this year. We've been practicing our leaps this year. All sorts of jumps. First, let's start with our sautés, okay? So my heels are touching, my toes are turned out in first position. Put your hands on your hips. We're gonna find our diamond, so we go diamond, and then we blast off from the floor, show me sauté. And again, blast off, sauté. Make sure you land in your diamond. Sauté, try it again. And sauté, one more time. Sauté, good job, dancers. How about second position? 
So start in second position, a little bit of space in between your feet. Show me your house. We go house, blast off, house, blast off, house, blast off, house, blast off. One more time, house, blast off. Good job. Let's go back to our first. All right, we also know how to achepe. Achepe is where our legs escape from first position into second. Do you remember? We jump to our house, ready? We jump to our house. We jump to our diamond. We jump to our house. We jump to our diamond. Two more times. Jump to your house. Jump to your diamond. Last time, jump to your house. Jump to your diamond. Awesome, you guys. All right, how about those padashahs? Now, padashah, that means step of the cat. So, we're gonna put our feet in first position. Let's take our hands like a kitty cat today. And we're gonna go up, up, jump to the right, ready? Padasha, beautiful. Go the other way, ready? Padasha, let's do that again. Padasha, good, last time dancers. Padasha, good job you guys. Up next are our piques. Now, pique means to prick. Just like Aurora on her spinning wheel, when she pricks her finger and she falls asleep because of the spell, we're going to prick our foot on the floor. You ready? We go up, pique, 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 close. Make sure it's a pointy banana foot. A pique, 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 close. Try the other side. Pique, 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 close. Last time. Pique, 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 close. Awesome, you guys. All right, up next, our red tirades. Now, this is where we make a number four with our leg. Do you remember? It's really important that you have a strong belly here so that we don't fall over. We go red tirade and down. Other side, red tirade and down. Retire and down. Retire and down. Beautiful. Take your toes together, heels together. Show me your airplane arms and let's do our flamingo walk. So we find our passe for this one. We go passe, extend and down. Use your pointy foot. Passe, extend and down. Keep going around your room. Passe, extend and down. Passe, extend and down two more times. Passe, extend, and down. Last one. Passe, extend, and down. Awesome. Okay, dancers, let's practice a couple of the things that we do when we go across the floor in class. Today, you can do them around the room at your house, all right? Very first thing that we do is our tiptoe walks. So we start with our heels together, our toes turned out, we take our arms down, Float them all the way up to your picture frame arms and find your releve. And then we go on tiptoes. Walk all the way around the room. Tiptoe walks. Good, keep going. Can you go a little faster? Tiptoe run. Beautiful dancers. What else do we do? Let's try our pointed foot walk. So this time we're gonna open our arms to our demi seconds and we'll find our Pointy foot walk. Beautiful ballet walks with a pointed foot all the way around your room. Good job. All right, up next are chasses. So let's start with airplane arms to the side and show me pointy banana foot that you're ready to go and do some chasses around the room. Chasse, chasse, chasse. Freeze. Let's go the other way. Pointy foot, airplane arms, and chasse, chasse, chasse. Beautiful. All right. Some skips. What are the rules of skipping? We're going to use our hands on our hips. We're going to use our pointy banana foot and our high passes. Ready? Skipping. Skipping. Around your room. 
All right, let's try to skip backwards. This one's tricky. Remember, you've still got to hop. Look behind you, make sure you're not gonna run into anything. Skipping and skipping and skipping. Good job, you guys. Dancers, I am so proud of you for working really hard in class this year. That is a giant review of everything we learned. Thank you so much for working hard this year, dancers. I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.